Welcome back to episode two of Bastion. We first episode we we woke up. Narrator is narrating our life, and we're saving these cores to to build up the Bastion, which is um, seems like a central area. So we're gonna hop right back in. Let's see what we got going, so we can practice. Squirt population was kept well under control thanks to this place. Okay, let's prove ourselves. Let's do it. The war machete strikes very quickly and its throwing attack provides added versatility. What? I don't have a throwing attack. Windbag Ranch was built for gathering squirt extract and copious supply. Ain't nothing more healthful. <laughs> Alright. Some folks showed up to make a fast buck with nothing but a knife. Other folks came to train them throwing arms. Still others used the place to test their finest blades. That was annoying. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Slippery little devils. Really glad I knew about that now. I'm an entire episode using this thing, practically. This is annoying. Ah, oh, come on. Ah, oh, come on, guy. Thank you. Surprise, of course. Man. That's okay, I needed that anyway. Woohoo! Oh, good. So yeah, that... I'm not the best, and I will never claim to be awesome, maybe, definitely. Ranch, so, you know. Smelling good and ripe. Hmm. <laughs> Dang. Oh, jeez. Well, that is definitely something. Blades per throw. Oh, cool. War oh, machetes are so one. quick, you gotta keep a good grip on them. Yeah, agreed. Oh. Ain't always much to say. Alright, let's find more cores. Getting them cores. Sundown path. Okay. Be careful up there. I will. Okay. Gaining experience levels raises maximum health. Good to know. Good to know. Couples used to walk the sundown path. Uh, Kid ain't here for pleasure, though. Yeah. That's for sure. I'm here to take names and slice things up and I'm all out of names. Doesn't well but then fine. Somebody gets to the core before the kid. What? The floor starts giving way under the lightest step. A single panic squirt could bring the whole place down. Fragments of the old world rain in the sky. Well 
path ain't exactly on the visitors no more. Ha! Oh, that's... Seriously? Wow. Portable telescopic lens. Cool. Air travel always was an iffy proposition. But calamity changed everything. Yeah. Even where the wind blows. Excuse you. Well, we mastered the winds in the old days. We can do it again. But the question is, who else could have taken the core? Yeah. Well, ain't no survivor stole the thing. Scumbag, he did my mistake. Yeah, that makes sense. They just little Kirby is just trying to make it in the Don't world. Break. Unlike the kid. Out back. No, they used to ship live munitions down the path. Hand grenade. Sweet. Who's wise to toss those things plenty far away? Kaboom. Nice. Even gas fellas need some shut eye from time to time. They get real cranky when you wake them up. I'm gonna run out of the old black tonic super fast. <laughs> In all this toil, kid keeps coming back to an overwhelming question. Oh my god. Who else could have survived the calamity? Well, that got real kind of quick. It's gonna be a lost love. So we didn't find the core that time, but that ain't about to stop us. Yeah. We could always see the stars. We just never could reach them, no matter how high we build. Yeah. Truth. I level up yet? No. Uh, come on, give the little tiger a break. Something burnt. Okay. Uh, yeah, we'll stick with that. All right, let's see what got added. Right. We've done all the other ones, so we might as well. Okay. okay. No place better than Trapper Shingle for learning to tread light and shoot straight. Trappers had to tread real careful here, else take a nasty fall. They train themselves by clearing out the targets while not clearing out the floor. Huh? 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 
Any good trapper knows never to take a step till the time is right. Surprise! Yeah! 64 something. Ooh. Abuya! Ah, R3. Okay. Thanks for telling me that now, game. <laughs> Ugh. I probably could have gotten all 64. To think a rickety place like the shingle survived. And so little else did. Okay. I still got everything I need. Let us away. Ooh. The Hanging Gardens. Beyond that, no telling what awaits. A veil hangs over this place. Ooh. Visit the forge to switch weapon upgrades to find the best combinations. Okay. The dead welcome him with open arms. Oh, <laughs> oh man. Uh. The calamity took everybody after all. Mm. Kids sees a plain, frozen faces all the time. You don't much care to see him. Not like this. Yeah. We're gonna pretend that didn't happen. Nothing happened. It's fine. I'm gonna stop breaking them. These folks never saw the calamity coming, but someone did. Someone close. Ugh. It's real finicky sometimes. Okay, I'm gonna blend it on that. Oh no! Whew, that was a close it one. Was someone. Oh no, there's a person there. The kid sees him there again, in the flesh. It's a snag or two trying to get to him. He ain't about to stop, no matter what. Okay, okay. Sweet. Shot. He's got so many questions after all. Ah, oh, what? I didn't need to do that. Just ain't got time for answers. Yeah. The ain't nobody got time for that. Didn't make it. Mm -hmm. They never saw what it was like beyond the walls. Nordy, the bird boy, didn't mm. make it. The Jawsons, they didn't make it. This is getting kind of sad. Grady Senior, Grady Junior, they didn't make it. But him, he survived. Kid finds proof enough that man ain't from around here. Just think, without that man, we wouldn't be here right now, would we? I don't know. The core survives as well.
that have done. And then, what do you say to a man who's seen too much? Kid hasn't a clue, but he says this. We have to go. Please. I'm very polite. You see, it's... I was brought up this way. <laughs> Don't tell my parents, though. Ugh. The survivor agreed to return to the bastion. Oh, goody. He's a proper gentleman, that man. His name is Zolf. Oh, it's a good name. No hiding, he's an Ura. Folks like him ain't never been a common sight in Ceylandia. Oh. He's new. He's relieved to see a living face or two. The kid and I introduce ourselves in kind. Nice. Both to him and to each other. <laughs> for the first time. I guess that makes sense. You're a sigil. We fought the Ura decades ago, but that was then. Things are different between us now. Okay. For Zolf, Ceylandia was like a second home. He's real worried about his first home, too. Oh. Far to the east. Okay. Zolf offers to help me plot the skyways for the kid. At least the calamity hasn't touched the stars, he says. Well, that sounds good. Stars are pretty. He was born in the Tazzle Terminals. The Ura sent him on a mission of peace to our city, and he's lived here ever since. Oh. Okay. Get out of here. Nothing. Hmm. Kid ain't finished here yet. Thanks. The cores. They remember. That's why this place is coming together. Yay. That's why things are gonna be alright. Nice. I have a real bad feeling about this. Because I'm getting the cores. Well, look what we have here. Huh. Holds and restores a variety of valuables. So you need a place to build it. Plans for a structure that chronicles past and future efforts. New I lost and found. Here, kid takes fragments of the old world and makes them whole again. Ah. Health food store. Oh. <laughs> nice. All it takes is some fragments, and the bastion makes it good as new. Memento. Yeah, I don't know what it does, but we're gonna find out. Sharp. Something coarse. Ooh, Graver Slash. Lightning fast flurry of strikes that can cut through even the toughest armor. One. Ah. I found it. You'll spoil. Alright. Oh, we got some things. I try to let the kid down gently. This is the bastion, alright. Except no one else showed up. What? We all lost loved ones in the calamity, he says. I don't know how I'm gonna go on without mine. Oh, jeez. Ooh, plus 20% critical hit chance. Or tax cripple. Vex stack. Sweet. I can dig it. So we just need a bunch of fragments now. We tried to find a couple more cores near the edge of the city. Ooh. Pythe Orchard or a Cinder Brick Fort. Um, we're gonna go with a uh, Pythe Orchard. Level up to raise the drink limit at the distillery. I would like that very much. Ooh. Hmm. 
No We're getting text. praying to the gods these days. No time for it either. I was just what? Why was I just laying around? Pith orchard. Place is a dead end in more ways than one. Ooh. Rich. A good Folks canoe. used to make pilgrimage here to pay their respects to Pith, the bull. Well, the gods are long gone now. And the orchard core is long gone too. Yeah, oh. The gods don't care about trinkets, but the kid ain't no god. Oh. Pith stood for something once. Something real. Something real, okay. That's good because something fake time, would though, make sense. The bull stopped being a symbol and started being decoration. Oh. I see you over there. I'm an explorer. Oh, that's a kitty cat. Ooh, kitty cat. Oh, yeah, I don't think I don't know. Oh. It was worth it's a try. a decent scarecrow, at least. Then Biff lights up like a rodeo. Yeah, dude. Must have been guarding that shrine. Yeah, it must have been. So what'll it be? Invoke the gods, oh. or tell them off? What? I don't want. What? I don't want to tell them off at all. God of commotion and order. Foes shall grow quicker to move and to strike. What? What? Why would I want that? I get no bonus, and no bonus. Piv. Yeah, we're gonna... Oh, no I do. Okay. Let's see what happens. Kid decides to press his love. Or if the gods are alive, they must be plenty sore. Kid ain't never seen windbags that quick. Maybe old Piff put a scare in him. Oh yeah. Oh. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. Man. No! Battle roll! Battle roll! Kid passes oh. Pith's trial. Sweet. And he's richer for it. Oh, come on. Oh, thank you. Kid ain't found the core, <laughs> but at least he found Zolf's precious shrine. Right. Ugh, that might have been a mistake. We'll see. We'll see how this goes. Ugh. Ugh. Visit the shrine. Now we can build a shrine of our own. Though I got some alternatives in mind. Oh? 
Zolf doesn't touch the thing. Says the god of commotion is no children's toy. Oh, I like that we're building the place up. Leura feared the gods. We turned them into toys, put their faces on our walls. Yeah. That's called idolism. Oh, ho, 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 he, ha. Right. Ooh, bullhead court proving ground. Very few emerged unscathed from the bullhead court, but many tried. All right, press L two just before getting hit to perform a damaging counter block. Ah, okay. Counter block. It's the best. The accused always got a fair shake in Ceylonia. Some used to take the bullhead trial. Yeah. Just like us. Survive the trial without taking a scratch. You'd walk away a free man. Oops. Oh, booyah. trial taught folks three things. First, a good defense is a good offense. Oh, that was fast. Second, you gotta always watch your back. Third, yeah. ain't no godlike bull up there gonna save you. Ugh. Nice. That was a good one. Oh. Oh, booyah. Attack me! Nice. I just want to be done. Ah, no! I'm gonna get third place again. Oops. Mind if I do, man. <sighs> Ooh. All right. I 
feel I feel Kill myself getting stronger. The bullhead trial. And I did. Go me. I'm cool. All right, Cinderbrick Fort. All right. I think I will then. Yeah. Do do do. Uh, all right, search for valuable minerals and mementos. There's only one way in the Cinderbrick Fort. <laughs> nice. The hard way. The hard I'm way. Sure, the says. city marshals may be gone, but now the fort's crawling with windbags. Wham! Kids ready for the windbags this time. Yeah, I am. Yeah, I am. Yeah, I really do wish that they had. I knew about that beforehand. The calamity was mercy. Oh. The wind bags ain't so lucky. You don't want to go back to your master? I can deal with that. I don't need to heal, yo. Alright, now I might need to heal. Unexpected. At least the marshals left the kid a pardon gift. Ooh, yeah. Something the windbags just can't handle. Something that'll punch clean through their greasy hides. Nice. Windbags. Choco Blast. To warm place to stay in a decent meal. The calamity drove the windbags topside. A lot of them wound up here in this very fort. Ooh, I love that. Leveling it up, leveling it up. That's what I thought. Get me them thick real. Could have been minding the business underground like in the old days. Alright. I'll take it. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. The bags Ooh, can't awesome. use the martial supplies, but the kids sure can. No, I like this. For now, anyway. As for the windbags, Cinderbrick gave them enough heat and metal to munch on for a while. Well, the fort ain't theirs by right. Can't blame them for wanting it, though. Yeah, that's true. Oh, excuse me. No.
Oh, oh, thorny flowers. Oh, wow. That worked quite well. I don't like that I'm also getting hit, though. If I'm countering, I should be countering. could go wrong then they bring out glutus and glandon all oh, their scumbag locals they got something to gain and only their sorry hides No, no, get out of there! Yeah, you like that? Yeah, that was the counter of all counters. Nope, oh, excuse you. Kid takes nice. that, Lutus. Maybe it was Blandon. Deuces. The other big fella soon joins his brother. Oh, that's not what I wanted to happen. No, thank you. What? Oh, he's so tiny. Oh, that's adorable. Not. The windbags finally get the message. It's like I'm playing Pac-Man. <laughs> Marshall's used badge. To dream of getting a Marshall's badge, but not like this. The Skyway's a welcome sight after all that. Yeah, it is. Oh, we left for nobody down at Cinderbrook Fort. Ain't nobody. The scrap musket is especially powerful up close, and consent flows fine. Hoo ha! Thanks. Kid shows up just as Ulf's telling me about his own journey to the city. Oh, lovely. Smoking pipe. Ulf brought his antique smoking pipe all the way from the terminals. Okay. The marshals seem like good men, he says. They treated him with dignity. I believe that. Marshals were good people. Seems the only thing the calamity saved for Zolf was his smoking pipe. Ah... Uh. Don't smoke, kids. Poor kid collapses after just one drag. <laughs> I believe that. Ah, okay. Options to select return to the bastion to back out of most areas. Good to know. Oh, oh God. Only good thing ever come out of the past is history. Oh, okay. Uh, well, let's see. Let's end this episode here. This is the end of episode two. Episode three, we're gonna we're gonna pick back up right in uh, Secret World. So, thanks for watching. Hit that like button. Subscribe if you want to see some more videos. Cause I'm gonna keep doing this for you. So, thank you. <laughs>